What's up guys, welcome back. In today's video, Arena asks, how can I change the photos that are in the homepage, like the lady with the phone and the writing machine? Thank you, great video. So Arena is of course referring to our four minute website video and we wanna change the slider gallery images. Also love that Arena posted that on the newest video, when we YouTubers make a new video, Google and YouTube gives us about a week or so to show that that video has comments and likes and stuff. And when you guys post them, it really helps us and it really helps show Google that it's it's worth it. And plus, no one likes crickets. So let's see how to do it. All right, so we're on the website here and these images are actually in pages. Remember, we focused on pages, pages, pages in this tutorial. So the pages themselves are in the dashboard. Let's go to the dashboard and let's go to pages. And now let's try to find the pages that are uh, creating those image sliders. So I think the first one is register a great domain. Oh, and I was wrong. So a better way to tell that is just to click learn more on the slider. And it takes us to the page that represents that slider. Great, right here. Now we click edit page and we can see the featured images right here. So if you wanted to put a different image as the slider background, just remove it, set featured image. And then we can choose a different image like this picture of Amsterdam. Set featured image, oops, and update. Now when we view our website, we'll see that we have a different image right here and we've changed the image of the typewriter and the desk. So if you're not seeing the right um, featured images here, then you don't have the pages assigned to your slider. We can change that in customize. And once you're in customize, you're gonna wanna click featured slider. And now down below, you can change the number of slides. So I just have two, but if you want three or four, just make three or four and then publish it and you'll get more spaces. And then in these little spaces, you have to select the right pages. And depending on what page you choose, it'll pull the featured image from that page and make it part of your slider. So contact us page doesn't have an image, so that doesn't look good. But if we did a different page which did have an image, then we would get a different background image. All right, also doesn't look very good. So this is how you control the pages that compose your slider. And then you go to the page itself and change the featured image to get that image to show up. I hope that helps. Um, big thanks to Arena for asking such a good question that I think can help a lot of users. And yeah, this is how free themes set up the slider a lot of the time. It's a really efficient way of getting the job done with a free slider and then you don't need to figure out, you know, super duper slider revolution or whatever they're calling it these days and pay for it. So you're good to go right here. All right, so that does it. Um, thanks a lot to Arena for asking the video. Thanks so much for posting on our newest tutorial here, the how to make a WordPress website at GoDaddy updated video. If you guys have questions, please direct them there. If you don't mind, it's a big help for me. And like I said, helps uh, the video in YouTube and in Google. And we don't have much time for that as YouTube creators. Please make sure to subscribe so that you get the answer to your question if you're featured and so that you get all the latest in WordPress tips, of course. Thanks again for watching because I really enjoyed making this for you guys. And I'll see you next time.